Hi everyone, just got here. We're up at uh, Woods Canyon um, Lake uh, Campgrounds, and uh, it's uh, up on the top of the uh, Sick Graves National uh, Forest uh, Rim, up on the Mongolian Rim. We're at about 7,800 feet, and uh, just got in, and uh, nice picnic table, a fire ring. Uh, and a charcoal stove, and we're in uh, number 126. And so uh, it's uh, about 70 degrees here. It's pretty nice. As a matter of fact, it's very nice. Real nice aspens, really tall pines. Really tall pines. Okay, I'll get back to you. Okay, we're at the end of the trail here, at the end of Meadow Vista Meadow Trail, Smoky the Bear. There's the boat launch down there. Beautiful lake, crystal clear. Here's the store up here. Get all your ice and your stuff for camping out. It is beautiful here. You get a kayak for one hour for fifteen dollars, paddle boards and electric trolling boats. Uh, here it is, on the boat ramp. Somebody's got their little bobber out there fishing. Very nice. It's about 70 degrees right now. Very, very nice. Okay, I'm working my way back here on the switchbacks up through the, through the woods. The lady was right. It's a quarter of a mile to the lake down, and it feels like four miles back. It's just up and up and up, switch back after switch back until you get up to the main road. So I'll get back to you guys. It's pretty though. I should keep it on because it is pretty here. Very, very pretty. Now, this is how you can tell you're up in the woods. There's a little butterfly, but there's ferns. Whenever you find ferns, there's a little chipmunk over there. 
But whenever you find ferns like this, you know you're in real woods. Oh, chipmunk. I get a little shot of the Ultra Star here. Okay, everyone, I don't know if you can hear it or not, but the wind blowing through these pine trees up here in Aspens, it's like the whisper of nature. Can you hear it? What a beautiful sound. What a beautiful sound. Hi everyone, I'm back. I'm at the uh, Woods Canyon Vista. This is the uh, top of the Mongolian Rim, which uh, travels uh, along the, uh, pretty much the center of, the, uh, of Eastern Arizona. And uh, it's a really a phenomenal place. Okay, I'm at the Woods, uh, Woods Canyon Vista Lookout, and we're going to walk down here and give you a little view of what I'm talking about. The, uh, we are way up, we're at 7,600 feet, and uh, trying to get a view of the... Uh, of the area. The uh, lookout here is, looks out over many, many miles. So, there's a spot over here. Don't fall off. Try not to. Pass. There it is. Wow. Wow. There it is. Oh. There it is. And I'm standing right on the edge here. Fortunately, the wind is blowing me back instead of towards the uh, towards the edge. A lot of pine. Fortunately, this area has been spared. I don't want to jinx it, but this area has been spared of uh, wildfires. Fortunately, and maybe because it's a little more moister, if that's a word, than uh, a lot of the other areas in Arizona. There are, have been some more wildfires, and there's still some going on. But uh, like I said, this area has been spared so far. So good. People have been careful. There it is. Hi everyone, I'm back. I'm uh, at the uh, one of the vistas, the overlook at the Mongolian Rim, another lookout. And uh, this is a lot like the Grand Canyon up here. It's, we're at, uh, like I said, like 7,600 feet. And uh, we're at this little pull-off vista. And I'm gonna show you what, how high up and, and uh, what the area looks like down here. Now, the thing is, the Grand Canyon, the, the outlooks, the overlooks and everything at the Grand Canyon, they have, uh, all kinds of places where you can step out onto the edge if you if you want to but you know you have to remember that's at your own peril and uh, this place reminds me of all the ledges and everything that are in the western western United States well actually all over the United States this looks like it's a little difficult to get down here Let's see, maybe there's a better spot. Pretty rocky. Uh, my knees aren't cooperating here. 
I don't want to fall over the edge. Anyway, like I said, you can get right out on the edge if you want, but it's at your own peril. Yeah, you know, a lot of people say, well, why don't they put fences up at the Grand Canyon? Well, you can't. I mean, there's a few guardrails and stuff, but even with the guardrails, you got uh, people that step out onto the edge, walk, go over the guardrails to get a better picture, and they lose their life. So uh, you have to be aware of that all the time if you're going to come out in places like this. But it's a beautiful place.